<laughs> well, I am, you know, the next thing I'm doing is I'm uh, part of this Fairly Brothers movie, Movie 101, which comes out in April. Um, it's a bunch of, it's every actor from, you know, Hugh Jackman to Kate Winslet. And I did a piece with uh, Elizabeth Banks and um, Josh Dumal and an animated creature that I love. I think it's funny as hell. Uh, the Fairleys were the first ones ever that were like, make it more disgusting, make it more fucked up, keep going with it, don't, uh, don't hold back. So I loved having producers like that. And, uh, and that's my next thing. I got a video game coming out um, next year as well. So those are my two upcoming things. And I'm figuring out what I'm going to do now. I have a comedy script I'm meeting with an actor about in a couple of weeks. I've got another action thing I'm working on. So it just depends on uh, kind of what emerges, you know. Well, how, I'm interested to know, how do you write a video game? Because, I mean, with every, you know, it diverges and goes every place. And you can't just write one, sit down and write one story. Explain to me how you do that, because I've never exactly, I guess, understood the concept of sitting down and writing a video. Yeah, well, I was very lucky in that uh, the, the video game was not my original idea. It was a company that came to me with something that they wanted to, to do. And they already had some of the you know artwork drawn up and things like that. And so they said, you know, we want this to happen, this to happen, this to happen. And so then it was my job to kind of put it all together in a story that made the sense. So what I did was I wrote the interstitials and I wrote all the dialogue for some of the situations, changed some of the situations around so it made more sense to an audience, and, and used my unique blend of humor and violence to be uh, a video game. Um, but it, 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 it's... Uh, it's very time consuming in one way because the scripts are like this long. They're huge because you do have to write the story going in different directions. It's almost like, you know, choose your own adventure as well as writing all the other little bits of dialogue that are in there. You know, when a character hits somebody with a, you know, a, a sword and the other guy says, you know, he can say ack, he can say shit, he can say, oh no, you know, you have to write all those little reactions. So it takes a long time, but it's also kind of, it's, it's, it's strangely also kind of easy because it's just, there's so much stuff. You really have this wide open landscape of imagination. It's a lot of fun, a lot of fun.